Hello and welcome to Let's Play in Crusader Kings 2 Return of Rome 2. As always, this is Densius. As you can tell, I'm substantially poorer than I once was from giving... Oh, yay! The province of Syria, Palestina. The whole of the ancient province of Syria, Palestina, has finally been liberated from the vile clutches of barbarians and restored to the Imperium Romanum. A great triumph will be held for the brave heroes who accomplished this feat. May their names echo in eternity. Uh, yeah, let us write the Tomb of Judgment. So yeah, I got bored giving out uh, money to these guys. <laughs> oh, I wonder. Can I, have I given you money before? I have. One of the th big things I discovered, though, was uh, this. No. You? No. You? Yeah, you're a Filthy Catholic. Blah. Remember, all religions that is not my religion, all cultures that are not my current culture, are wrong. Entirely. It's like if, if I'm playing a Greek, everyone other than Greek is wrong. If I'm playing as a Spaniard, everyone other than Spanish is wrong. I always play it from that perspective. I could holy war for you, I suppose. No, I can't. I'm too far away to holy war for you, I suppose. Uh... And the good thing about me dying is uh, that I, all my, everything's reset. Everyone's, uh, whatever of me is reset. There you go. Barbarians. Big question becomes, to what do I holy war next? How many provinces do you have personally? If I take Cordoba, hmm, it really will depend. I'm going to try. But if I take Cordoba, actually, I'm going to head over here first and kill those people uh, and grab the Holy Order as well. That's why part of the reason why I'm heading over there. Plus, when my son comes of age, I'm going to give him the Duchy of Galilee. Hmm, lustful and strong. Yeah, it was a good thing. Oh yeah, I've got to, to do that, haven't I? Uh, you. 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 There we go, I feel safe. Uh, I'm to... I rule in the room. Is there anything I can really do at that point after having just done what I just did? Oh. Thanks. Probably build another army of. Uh... I could nearly build another army. So yeah, the reason I'm going to go after Cordoba rather than the coastal province is because you can only usurp. You can't usurp. Like for example, if he um. Yeah, you cannot usurp. Yeah, for example, I hope by usurping the Cordoba, he confiscates a land outside of Andalusia's de jure. And makes that his new seat. Otherwise, uh, it, it will have been a waste. But if he gets, for example, takes that and makes that his new capital, I can, I will probably be able to usurp the Duchy of Andalusia, the kingdom, sorry, and fragment his entire empire, kingdom, and then I'll be able to holy war piecemeal. I have finally worked it out that you can do that kind of occasionally. The Emperor sees all. Stewardship's improved. Oh, nearly. Hey, you. Sudden appearance. Sneak attack. Oh, I have a kinswoman who's of age. She's quick and chaste. And she's celibate. I'm not getting any more kids from her. There we go. And this one, again, it's just as distant as the other one. I mean, she's chaste, but she's quick and she's young, so I should be able to 
get some kids out of her. Plus, plus in I suppose from like the roleplay perspective, I'm marrying a daughter of the previous emperor. That's bound to secure, get increase my claim on the throne better, and my acceptance throughout the empire. Because I, I, essentially, I'm such a distant relative of the previous emperor that I'm essentially I'm sure there are people of other dynasties that are closer related to him by marrying his sister or or being his aunt, being his their mother or something. And that's what used to happen. It used to, uh, it's like, um, with the death of Hen King Henry VIII in England, there was a move to put, to bypass the el the, the daughters, his two daughters, which is Mary, who was a Catholic, and Elizabeth, who was a. Uh, actually, you're not going to smash this army. Uh, Elizabeth, who was a Protestant, because they couldn't just bypass Mary and move it straight to Elizabeth, because they had to try to bypass the, his entire, all his children, otherwise there'd be issues. So what they decided to use was, I think it was Henry the Seventh, Henry the Eighth's father's, and uh, like daughter's son's daughter's daughter. They decided to try and put on the throne, Lady Jane Grey, Jean Grey, Jane Grey. Hang on, am I confusing Spider Man? Yeah. Anyway, uh, green sleeves. No, that's someone else as well. Oh my god, I'm, it's been a while since I read this stuff up. Uh, yes, it's out of the it's out of the kingdom. I can usurp this if I have fifty percent. But anyway, they, Lady Grey, they wanted to put her on the uh, the throne, and it was mainly her parents that were the big push to try to put her on the throne. Especially as she had been. Oh, I know this is. She had initially been more or less promised to Edward, uh, King Henry's son, but Edward was sickly and died and he named her the heir. That's right. Sorry, I got that confused. Rather than any of his sisters. Uh, she didn't rule for very long and never got officially crowned. But um, they tried to have... It. She was in an unhappy marriage and the parents... And they, they tried to set it up so... Um, That's a future king, emperor, a duchy of Galilee. There you go. Where is my son? There he is. But yes, hopefully this war will end, and then I'll be able to uh, usurp the duchy, the kingdom of Andalusia. And shatter. I think that's how it goes, unless that might just be. I have to look. I have to quickly look again. I might be talking at my backside. Can't do it from someone who's at war. But um, yeah, I'm a scholar. Pardon me. Maybe there are different rules depending on religion. Uh, it might be that I can't usurp it if any of the kingdom still is held within that. But normally, if uh, in other situations I've had, it doesn't work that way. Oh, pardon me. Barcelona. Oh. Now to find out. Aha! Take that, everybody else. Alright. I think it's time to holy war everybody. I can't holy war you, though. Uh, you. I can holy war you. I can holy war you. I can holy war you. Uh, I can holy war you. Can't holy war you. Maybe because you have a... Uh, yeah, you're you that guy. Holy war you. Still accidentally keep selecting that guy to holy war. Holy War You. Holy War You. Mm. I think that's everything. Begin! Take as much of Spania as possible.
Take what I can. Give nothing back. Charge. Holy war for everything. But yeah, there's plenty of examples in history where you would marry uh, someone in order to gain claims and the like. Like, um, this isn't an example from history, but in the world of a Game of Thrones, when Aegon the Conqueror, 300 years or so before the start of the show, uh, came to Westeros and conquered it with his dragons and his, his two sisters, uh, the original leader of the Stormlands, the original uh, king of the Stormlands, uh, only had a daughter. And Oris Baratheon, the half, the illegitimate half brother of uh, the Conqueror, Aegon the, Con the Conqueror, um, took, uh, defeated him in single combat and slayed, slew him, and uh, married his only daughter. And they became a. Uh, Already conquered that one, and that's how um, the Baratheons became in charge of the Stormlands uh, through a conquest and marriage to enforce the claim a bit further. Ah, these lands are officially reunited via this tiny little gap there. Did I, did I, did I put on the timer? I did. Right. The eternal question that always goes through my head when I've been recording a bunch of videos in a row is, did I put the timer on? Uh, in case anyone ever actually wondering why I have put a timer on, it's so that I have a good idea. I record roughly the same amount. I also roughly get the, uh... No family, eh? That's sad. No, just just power through it. Defeat everybody, take all their lands, and then distribute the lands. There's a hundred percent there. I'm gonna take most of Hispania and then sort of like leave it for the Catholics and no, leave it for the Orthodox and the Catholics to uh, capture after that. And then I can take it from them. And thus the circle of life continues. Make him disappear. Excellent, you're dead. Uh, you're okay. Ha! Huh, how dare she? I'm emperor. Well, they don't like me. Okay, now it's clear to me that I need to start distributing some of the lands I've just acquired. Otherwise people are going to get really upset with me. And I need piety. I always need piety. Part of the reason why is because uh, it's not something I ever really show in the show, in the uh, in the videos, but uh, score only matters to me in terms of comparing the different emperors down the generations. And piety goes towards score, and that's kind of why it matters, at least to me. Beyond that, I don't really care. Uh, but victory is mine in many things. There we go. Fine. Such realm. You. Congratulations. You are going to be a duke of there. Such realm. You. No. Uh, yeah, no. You. Don't want any possible inheritance problems. That's for future people to, to deal with. Yeah, you're not mine, though. You're just someone else. 
Not you. Too old. You. Congratulations to the Duke of Lombardy. You. Wait, no. Yes, you. Are there any other duchies I can give out? There is. Hmm. Now there are a couple of counties there. You can have the county of Zaragoza and the county of there. There we go. Now stop being all angry. Hello, kinsman. Ah, they were. Faction goes away now, because I was so nice to them. Let's just watch the factions disintegrate. There we go. Factions aren't really a danger at this point. Not to me. It doesn't really matter to me if you flee or not. My daughter came of age. Uh, you're a Greek vassal. Uh, you. Oops. 22% in my favour. 58. 78. Charge. Just seek, locate, destroy. Victory. Ah. I'm going to finish up the last two, uh, the, uh, this little campaign in Hispania and then uh, end the video. Charge. Charge faster than you're currently charging. Uh, hurry. Charge! No! I'm body's cursed. Right. You. 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 Destroy. You. Alright, I'll do this distribution thing uh, off camera and be back in a minute. Thank you for watching. My name has been Tensius. Ciao for now.